Saudis had a more of a middle path statement calling for a cessation of uh, hostilities. India has a very unambiguous statement. It did not take any kind of middle ground. It very squarely said India stands in solidarity with Israel. It described what's happened as a terror attack uh, by by Hamas, though the prime minister's statement doesn't name Hamas. Uh, I just I just want you to come in on the geopolitical significance of both the Indian position and what has happened and what is happening rather because it's going to happen right now over the next few days and we actually don't know where it's headed. Well, uh, Barkha, first of all, uh, like many people in India, I'm sure not just the Prime Minister, but the people of India stand in solidarity with uh, our friends in Israel at this point of time. You know, looking at the videos, looking at the uh, reports that are coming, uh, to me, it had a lot of shades of our own 2611 uh, when you had terrorists coming from Pakistan on boats and uh, uh, creating the rampage that they did. And if you recall, um, there were some explicitly Israeli and Jewish targets that those terrorists had uh, uh, attacked. Uh, you know, so, 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 uh, particularly post 2611, we saw how cooperation uh, between India and uh, Israel on counterterrorism, on intelligence sharing, um, really took off in a different uh, uh, dimension. I have no, uh, I have no doubt that Israel is going to come back hard uh, at the terrorists. 